Hello everyone, it's Q to the Fail, and welcome to Getting Over It with Bennett Foddy. This is, uh, it got moved on, t it, I don't know what it originally was on, probably Steam or something like that, but, uh, they, uh, put it on a phone game. And I made the mistake of putting it on, uh, taking a screenshot of it from Google Play and posting it on Facebook, stating that for $5 I could break my phone. Because if you know anything about this game, you know it's a rage game. It's intentionally made to make you mad. To make you lose your absolute mind. And I'm not looking forward to it. I had a lovely subscriber send me money so I could purchase this. I didn't realize that he hated me so much. But uh, now I know. <laughs> so I guess that's good to know. I know that it's awful. I've watched uh, Jacksepticeye play it, and I've watched Markiplier play it, and uh, I, I will throw out that between the two, I'm going to end up more likely being a Mark, because I am the type of person who will... I get mad very easily. I very much do. It's one of those things where I try not to, but it... Eh, it happens. Um, but, uh, yeah, I watched them play, and uh, I don't think Jack really played much of it because it's such a rage game. He's not really the type of person who gets mad, like legitimately. I know he acts a big game about getting mad, but it's like for all fun and game and stuff like that. But he, this game actually legitimately made him mad within like the first three minutes of him playing it. <laughs> Mark, I think, I don't, I don't remember if it was this one where he ended up throwing his chair. So I'm honestly afraid to play this. But yeah, he... Uh, the subscriber sent me money, and I was like, why? He's like, I think it'd be funny to watch you get mad. So, hopefully, I can tolerate it long enough to not break things, because I don't have the money to replace things. Uh, it basically just kind of started as soon as I opened up the game. He was in his little cauldron thingamajiggy. And I am hoping, beyond hope, this is not going to be too terrible on a phone. Because I don't know how to play it. I've never done it, so... And I've also never done it on the computer either, because so, I don't play rage games because I rage. So let's get into this. Uh, it's not awful. Okay, you just kind of spin it around. How to make him swing? Oh, that's how. Oh God, this is going to be awful. Don't. I mean, he's going to anyways because I'm I'm kind of screwed where I'm at. Huh? No. Okay. <laughs> well. Yeah, this is going to be fun due to the fact that my hand's going to be mostly in the way. So I don't know how well I can proceed. Yeah, I don't know if anybody, I don't know if anybody watching has seen anybody play this. But it's one of those, there are checkpoints. But you could still very easily get very, 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 very far into the game. And, uh... There's no lose. feeling more intense than starting over. If you deleted your homework the day before it was due, as I have, or if you left your wallet at home and you have to go back after spending an hour in the commute, if you won some money at the casino and then put all your winnings on red but it came up black, if you got your best shirt dry cleaned before a wedding and then immediately dropped food on it, if you won an argument with a friend and then later discovered that they just returned to their original view, starting over is harder than starting up. If you're not ready for that, like if you've already had a bad day, then what you're about to go through might be too much. Feel free to go away and come back. I'll be here. <laughs> Why did you stare at your hammer so long? Eh. Eh. And I'm kind of, I'm going to have to... Bye, taskbar. That's going to make my outro even more annoying. Uh, but I have to move that taskbar because with my hand being all over the place... How do I get out of this? Uh oh. Uh oh. Break the tree. 
Eh. Mm. Mm. Okay, can you get around the stick? Maybe I can glitch it. Come on. Wiggle. Uh. I'm holding onto my phone with both hands. I'm trying to make this work. Mm. Don't you dare. Tippy tap. Tippy tap. I don't remember how to make you swing. Boop. Uh. Jump. <laughs> Jump, dude. Use your legs. Use your colchin legs. <laughs> Oof. Man, this is. I'm gonna spend like nine days on just this freaking tree alone. Oh my god. Oh my. Dude. Dude. Is that. Mm. Mm. How do I make you do things? Mm. How do I make you do right things? Dear lovely subscriber, just so you know, if I end up breaking my phone, you're buying me a new one. Get over the tree! Lower, lower, lower. Oh, I will hurt you. I need... The thing... To... Move upwards. Lower down. Oh, that's gotta be painful. Yeah, yeah, you can see where you're supposed to be going, so get there. Yeah, the people that put this on Game Phone Noodle Cakes, I don't know if they're like the original people of the thing. I don't know really much about this besides the fact that it's frustrating. Uh. I don't like you. <laughs> I don't like me either, because I should have never posted anything about it. I'm not going to be able to pass this tree. <sighs> How do you get over the tree? Oh my god. There isn't a way you can make him just like drop. <laughs> nope, that doesn't help. Putting it here doesn't help because Ooh, keep it over here. The only thing it's doing is going to the bottom of the thing in which he can't get over that way. Mm. Hello everyone, this is Kyoto Fail, the person who can't get over a tree. get over the tree. Mm. Here, I got an idea. Let's try it again. Uh, or 
or you can go back these controls are absolutely insane they're crazy they make no sense They make no sense. <sighs> eh. No. Ooh. Oh my god, I got over the tree. Let go of the tree. Let go of the tree. The tree's done. Thank you. And we have another tree-like thing. Whoa! We're done with the tree. Oh, wait. Go. 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 Hey, hey, hey. Let go of the rock. Honestly, I've made more progress than I thought I would at all. Bop, bop, bop. Minecraft. Right. All right. Thanks for coming with me on this trip. I'll understand if you have to take a break at any point. Just find a safe place to stop and quit the game. And don't worry. I'll save your progress, always. Oh. Even your mistakes. <laughs> Thank you for saving my this mistakes. This game is a homage to a free game that came out in 2002, titled Sexy Hiking. The author of that game was Jazuo, a mysterious <gasps> Czech designer who was known at the time as the father of B-games. And B-games are rough assemblages this. of found objects. It's a Designers slap them together very quickly and freely, and they're often too rough and unfriendly to gain much of a following. They're built more for the joy of building them than as polished products. Forward. We're supposed to be going forward. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Dance, dancey puppet. <laughs> yeah, I think this is a lovely place anyways. I'm sure he could pull out a fishing pole or something if he could put his arms down. Thank you. Appreciate it. Love it. Oh, and just so you know, dear subscriber, I am not going to make the phone cheap, and I'm turning everything. <laughs> I try to get this to go so well that my pushing, I guess I think that if I push harder, it'll make it better, and it's not going to work. So don't turn the phone. Didn't you have your arms up higher a little bit ago? Can you honestly not succeed in life? <sighs> Do your parents support this, by the way? Do they think, you know, whatever makes you happy? To sit around in a cauldron and get around by a hammer? Let's, let's go ahead and go up mountains and stuff like that with a hammer. Whatever makes you happy. Eh. Woohoo! Okay. Eh, 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 eh. Eh. Oh. 
slow, slow, slow. We're gonna just move that. We're not gonna do that either. Dink. Dink, 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 dink. So it doesn't work. Oh, yeah, get back um, up there. I said get back up there. No. Oof. <sighs> Bunk. That is not okay, sir. Mm. I did not tell you any of that was okay. Ah. <sighs> oh, that's not good positioning. Oh, don't do things like that. Mm. Hang there. Just hang there. It's fine. Keep it away from anything that could push or pull or fling or anything, dude. No, no. Get back up there and straight. Oh, I hate you so much. Oh. <gasps> no, 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 dude. Okay. <laughs> so. Okay. Alright, I'm going to leave you there for a minute. I'm going to go ahead and end the video here. I made progress. I actually got over the tree, so I'm excited about that. I will, unfortunately, be back with another freaking video. So until then, have a good day. If you would please like and subscribe and comment or whatever, share my video. That would be greatly appreciated. Have a good day. Bye.